Hello Virgo, welcome to my channel, welcome to the reading for the month of September. For this reading I am using the coffee cup and then I'll be drawing out cards from the Tower of the Divine deck here and then I will be drawing out some lovely rune stones for you as well that I'll be reading from. Okay, lovely Virgos, also a very happy birthday day to all you beautiful Virgos it is Virgo season happy 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 birthday and I wish for all your dreams and the, your best intentions to all come through okay beautiful Virgos let's see what we have for you Virgo 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 time is on your side Virgo time is on your side and that is such a good thing to have and a good feeling also there's like lots of um f like you feel there's a fuzziness in your stomach <laughs> fuzziness there's like uh like you're feeling good about something there's a warmth there you know it's like mm, that kind of feeling it, it's it, you just feel there's some sort of change transformation going on within you there is something that um and, and the reason why I see time is on your side is because you realize that everything that has happened or where you are currently you know is you've always been um, protected or saved you're, you're always going to be in the right place at the right time even when it doesn't feel like it but you were there for a reason you're you're here for a very big reason that you get to discover, that you get to see, realize. Something about a property, ownership, perhaps you're looking to own a property or something like that, or being a landlord, and it's very specific here. Um, some news will come in that will put you at ease as well. There were some conditions that you, um, are wanting to you're wanting some conditions to be met by and I do see you've been you know you've been patient you've been holding out and it, it does come through somebody agrees like I do see a deal uh, happening negotiations that go in your way and yes you may have to compromise on a few things here and there but that's okay it does say something about try not to harbor any um, any bad feelings over somebody or some situation because it's not worth it. Um, there's other things that are going to come in that's going to need your attention um, in, in a good way. You, you could find yourself being very, very p busy. There's a step in the right direction is what I'm seeing, Virgo. For many of you, it's a step in the right direction. Some news, again, I see is coming in that I do see you will be quite happy with. And you will feel very, like, um, accepted or war there's this warmth e energy not that you n not like you're looking for acceptance from other people not at all but f from within you you know um you have some skill here that is um sought after or it's being um being seen being like you know you could be um headhunted here looking for a promotion there's something here that puts you over the edge of from from others you know there's there's something that i also see is going to be resumed and you're going to it's, it's like there's some parts of september that will be jam-packed for you jam-packed something will be resumed an idea or project something here but and, and the stress will be um because I do see some stress that was around it, some nervous energy stress that will be taken off you, off your shoulders here. Some big romantic gestures coming in, some, you know, I see a lot of passion here, um, but also you're not really, it could be you that you're not wanting to look into this too seriously because you have other things going on, um, taking your time. But again, I do see like passion. Um, like you're not wanting it to completely become your main focus. You're 
for some of you, you know, you, you got like, even though your path, you can see, okay, there's still a long way to go. The fact that you're in, on the right path in the right direction, you know, you, you couldn't be happier because of that. There is also something about you having to step out of your comfort zone, which you're going to start to enjoy. And it's like, you see, you know, life can be a roller coaster and everything, but I see you gliding, you're gliding through it, absolutely gliding through that. I love it. Okay. There could be a change in your job role and your position also, is what I'm saying. Let's see what the cards have for you. Eight of coins, eight of coins, okay. Eight of cups. Mm. And the six of swords. Wow, look at that. Really moving forward, moving across. You know, there's something that you are ready now to do. And as I was saying, a step in the right direction. This is all about going across, you know, going onto calmer waters here. The eight of coins is you kind of working hard always focusing on what you have in front of you making the most of it being able to be very wise with how you spend your energy or money or whatever it is um, building on something that you can fall back on um, but there is i also see it of coins like once you start something and you progress there's such a strong continuation that it gives you this this area, this space for you to have a sense of freedom as well, because you're not just doing something willy nilly or just taking a risk with anything for you without a, a safety net. You have a safety net and you're going towards this calling. And I do see is also you're very much what I see here um, in the right. You know, it's a good time, you know, it's something that is positive. Uh, and if you don't do it now, when will you? You know, it's like no time like the present. Leaving something behind, walking into harmony. Um, you, you know, no, no longer. You're saying, you know what? I don't want to live in this kind of turbulence anymore. Not knowing when things are gonna. As we were saying, life is like a, a roller coaster. But now you're starting to glide through it. Love this. You see, there's like the, these choppy waters, but now they are sailing onto the calmer waters here. And that is a decision that you make that you, you I see, looking forward to. Oh, love it. The Six of Wands and the Strength card. Yes. Uh, go. Yes, yes. Six of Wands and the Strength card. You know, no one can knock you off from this high level of success that you get that you are you know you're putting something out there that comes back in a very strong way in a, in a positive result and I, I do see you get seen like I was saying there's some sort of skill or something that you have or you know it's like you definitely get seen and internally here with the strength, I do, you know, you've perhaps had to battle with a few things here and there, but always manage to be level headed. You know, you're in the right direction, going in the right direction here. And you have the courage also, we were talking about uh, perhaps sometimes having to step out your, of your comfort zone. Um, and there's something. It's like whatever it is that you tackle or that you have to go through a challenge, you do it gracefully. And nobody on the outside knows exactly what you go through. But you're being rewarded, lovely Virgos. You're being rewarded in, in, in you know, beautiful, beautiful ways with the sun. I love how the sun has come out for you. Especially here in your birthday season. Yes. Ah, love it. Love it. See, I, I, something is coming in soon that I, I do see you will be very happy and pleased about. You know, it's like 
because of the action that you've taken, you can now enjoy this ride, enjoy the ride, enjoy it, gliding through it, because you know you have the sun there around you to always shine that light wherever you're going forward. And also keeping, there's some promises also that are being kept. Um, and I see um, you're gonna really know who your true friends are and they're really gonna like make a difference here i love it this is something that you you're like yeah this is a positive change that i'm uh, uh i'm making and it's like the gift that keeps giving you know all right oh this is the rune of wonjo I'll, I'll draw out three three runes for you this rune of wonjo here this is the rune of Lagos and a third the third one third one. Oh and this is the rune of Algiz. Okay, okay. Alright, love this. The rune of Onjo is very much like the sun is the rune of joy of success, but you also have this peace. It's a great confirmation, exactly what we're talking about here. Love this. It's the rune of, of um, things that you are surrounding yourself that gives you pleasure, you know? And it's because you've all kind of, you've made it happen in that way. And you're being very wise and, and because you're choosing wisely, you know, to keep what makes you happy, the happy surroundings. And this is the rune of um, Lagos, which is the rune of flow, of renewal, something that... I see is fresh, perhaps a clean slate, but it's one that you, oh, the, the flow, you know, the renewal here, the sense of, you know, you've gone through certain hardships and now it's the time for you to be able to enjoy this serenity, enjoy the changes that you are creating. And here the rune of Algiz is the rune of protection and again we were talking about here with the sun i take this as a confirmation you will always be guided and protected in that way because you're being guided in a very strong way and also to to it's a reminder to keep your guard up even if things are very happy and going the right way it is important to still keep your guard up because you you know you never know what may come out of left field but you'll be okay as long as you you know um keep going the way you are with that strength of yours loving this virgo thank you so very much for being here i really hope that this was helpful please do let me know appreciate all of you so very much please do take care and until next time